the team right now, uh, all the way from the very top. You know, Bill, I, I started calling Bill Bob recently because I'm, I'm trying to enact his alter ego where he's being progressive and kind of moving things forward. And he's always talked about, you know, being the best and doing all the, you know, that's kind of a progressive thought anyway, is being the best because obviously you're breaking new ground if you're if you're ahead of everyone else. And now it's really, it's a great feeling to see the new blood um, in the administration and, and in the coaching staff, uh, you know, starting to really take off with a few of these ideas that are having great impacts on the athletes. You know, the athletes are, are showing, you know, performance levels and results levels that they have never done before. And, and um, not that that's entirely based on, you know, innovations in the, in the program, but certainly some of that is. And I think that's an important part. For me personally, you know, it just kind of goes full circle. You get back to a place where now I'm, I'm doing this, I would say, partly for myself, whereas in the beginning I was doing it almost entirely for myself. It was about my, my you know, career, my, um, you know, financial situation, and my uh, love for the sport. So, you know, now it's kind of come full circle. I'm trying to leave the sport maybe better than, than when I showed up and, and leave the team better than when I showed up and try to, you know, activate some of these programs that I really feel like have a chance to grow and, and evolve when I'm, when I'm retired. I think unrestricting equipment is key. I mean, you know, they, they've shown that restricting equipment across the board in almost every sport does not help. I mean, the things you can restrict are things that are that are truly safety oriented. Helmets, you know, are a perfect example. Um, you know, I think that's that's a big part of letting the sport evolve outside of those kind of restrictions. I sort of activate my fitness down there. I mean, I'm doing a bunch of stuff now, but it takes. Uh, it takes time, so that's a good block for me when I'm on snow. You get the fitness element on snow, and then I do double sessions in the afternoon, so um, that's usually mostly what I get out of it. I try to get the basics of my equipment setups dialed in so that I know where I'm at. And